Hello everybody, this is the Daydreamer with Daydreams and Nightmares and it is time for round number 13 of my thank yous and shout outs to my subscribers. If you're, finally, or if you're just tuning into this one and you haven't seen any of the others, what I have been doing for my subscribers as a thank you to them, instead of doing a giveaway where I might have one or two winners, um, I'm trying to do something for everybody as, as a thank you. Uh, in part uh, hoping that maybe it will also help grow the YouTube community out there uh, and also with some of these channels maybe help grow their subs as well and given uh, people that watch my videos that may be interested in some of the things that I like and maybe some of the things that brought these people to me in the first place might be something that you're interested in and it might be something uh, it might be a channel that you wouldn't have originally actually gone to check out I know uh, with respect to some of the names that are out there on some of these YouTube channels it would be kind of misleading as to uh, what it is that they're about and what their channels are so when you're doing searches for uh, things out there that might interest you you won't always run across some of these because the names don't actually bring you there but um, what I'm going to do is as I have been doing uh, shouting out 10 uh, YouTube subscribers of mine in each of these videos down in the description I will leave links to all their channels so you can go check them out if it's something that interests you please feel free to sub them up show them some love uh, it's not required if it's not something that you're interested in just thank you for giving them a chance anyway uh, and uh, right now we are like I said this will be number 13 so I've done about a hundred and twenty or so so far uh, of my subscribers. Uh, there's going to be about 35 that I don't do shout outs for uh, because they don't show their subscriptions publicly so I don't see that they're subscribed to me uh, which more than likely means as will be with uh, some of these uh, that I run across on my list as well uh, basically a created account so they can watch videos and comment and enjoy the content that's out there rather than making content themselves and I think I have at least one on here like that in this group here but let's get going uh, these are the next 10 on my list first one off is 8-bit Beck uh, definitely go check out her channel if you're into collectibles gaming or unboxings uh, that's primarily what she does on her channel, although I think she's trying to broaden some of the uh, things that she does on her channel. If nothing else, it was recently her birthday. Go over there and wish her a happy birthday uh, and check out what she has to offer. Uh, next on my list is Franklin F. M. McKinnis. Uh, another uh, YouTuber out there that does unboxings. Primarily uh, his focus seems to be on Funkos. Uh, but he does other collectibles as well. He does, has some comic books and figures and other things that he does on his channel as well. And he's actually created some other additional channels uh, as well for some of the other things that he's interested in uh, uh, artistically. I know he has one that he does uh, that he puts out his poetry that he likes to write on another other another channel. But a very good channel and very active within the unboxing community as well. Uh, friends with a lot of other fellow unboxers in the uh, YouTubing community, uh, YouTube unboxing community, um, and I see uh, uh, quite a few acts of kindness between him and channels like Cat D and GG's and uh, some others that are out there. Uh, and uh, he actually uh, helped encourage uh, another YouTuber who I think has recently subscribed to me. Uh, who does a lot of custom work. Uh, Sherry Stover does some work for him, actually created a pop for him, uh, of him uh, as well, which was kind of neat. Uh, if you go check out his channel, one of the, the regular segments that he does, on, uh, if you're really curious about what's out there in collectibles and Funkos and things like that, every Saturday he does a uh, Funko News, uh, uh, letting people know about all the different things that are going to be coming out with uh, collectibles and Funkos. Uh, that they've announced and things like that. So if you want to keep up to date on what's going to be available, he's a really good source for that. He does a lot of digging and, and gets all that information all together and, and usually has images that he's managed to gather up as well, um, see what's out there. Definitely go check him out. Uh, next two guys on my list are Rube the Great and D-Bag Robot Gang. 
uh, two guys from the group called Syndicate. They are a group of uh, toy hunters. Uh, they do like doing collectibles and toys and figures and, and Funkos and all that wonderful stuff. But they do a lot of video logs, uh, them going out and doing toy hunting. Uh, I think it's a group of seven different guys. I've talked about a few of them uh, earlier in some of the other uh, shout outs that I've done. But uh, definitely go check those guys out. Uh, next on my list is Pete WK, a uh, friend of El Hombre Gordo, another YouTuber that I've gotten to know pretty well. Uh, he recommended checking him out, and uh, I uh, have subscribed to him. He does challenges, unboxing, collectibles as well. Uh, his channel, very nice guy, uh, recently did a giveaway, although uh, because of shipping from England, where he's from, uh, to here, it gets kind of outrageous. He was giving away a whole stack of, he does uh, unboxings, and he's not into comic books, uh, but was giving away basically all the comic books that he had gotten over the last year or two from from the different uh, boxes and crates that he's gotten. So that was kind of neat. I wish I could have gotten involved with that, but uh, once again, get when you get a whole stack of uh, comic books and put them in a box, it gets kind of heavy. It's really expensive to ship them, but uh, definitely go check out his channel. Uh, next one on my list is Sarah Fett, a uh, YouTuber out there that, I, if based on her channel, I'd say that she's mostly a vlogger. Uh, has subscribed to my channel recently, uh, within the last month or two, and uh, I haven't had much of a chance to check her out. I know she's into Star Wars and occasionally does a few unboxings, but predominantly what she has out there is, uh, is uh, video logs uh, on her uh, channel. But definitely go check her out, show her some love if that's something that you're interested in as well. Uh, next one is Stoner Smitty. Uh, he is one of those that I had, uh, He's a, I think he only has like 10 uh, subscribers. Uh, the, I think con last content he put out was about two or three years ago. If that's, I think that might be about right. Uh, it looks like to be, he uh, is, a, is a paintballer and uh, looks to be one of those that actually created a channel just kind of check out other other people's content doesn't have much there as well but thank you very much for subscribing to my channel and sticking around uh, next one on my channel is Sledneck 15 uh, growing his channel pretty quickly and uh, uh, very rightly so uh, I enjoy watching it's always entertaining uh, to watch what he has to put out there uh, not necessarily always family friendly uh, he, as he recently said that uh, YouTube is uh, adult uh, uh, restricted a lot of his his uh, videos um, and uh, but it's always worth checking out uh, but he is into horror uh, wrestling and uh, he recently put out a video too where he's out doing some video logs where he's out uh, uh, snowmobiling and and uh, recently had an accident with his truck and things like that 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 he's put on his channel and been checking out and watching and but uh, always entertaining always fun to watch and he does have a contest going on right now as well uh, definitely worth checking out as well he's given away uh, six different prizes six different crates and each one of those people has the opportunity besides the crates that he's giving away uh, also to win, uh, he's giving away two $100 Amazon gift cards, two uh, $50, sound right, and four, anyway, $400 worth of uh, Amazon gift cards. Go check out his videos, uh, see what it is that he has going on. Uh, he's going to put together, uh, 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 I think it's six winners that he has in, intending on giving and, and boxes for every one of those besides the gift cards. Uh, but always entertaining videos as well. Um, if you're into wrestling, if you're into horror, uh, his channel is definitely worth checking out. Uh, Manny NYC. Uh, this guy has uh, a lot of comic books from the golden and silver and bronze age. He likes collecting a lot of the older comic books, uh, CGC books as well, slab books that he has on his channel. Um, uh, definitely well worth checking out. Uh, Many NYC is also, I should mention as well, he is part of the group uh, that call themselves the New York Warriors and they do put on a regular show as well through uh, Big East Comics uh, and he's part of that group so they're, they're worth checking out as well. Uh, definitely uh, show, show some love if you're into the comic book. He's one of the members of the comic book community. 
does like I said, does a regular show with. Uh, um, I'm trying to remember who the other guy is. Is it Marky three one six? Uh, Biggie's Comics and uh, Manny NYC, and then they have a few other guys that uh, are involved in uh, in that group uh, for the New York Warriors. Uh, and last on my list here is Night Wolf L S L C. Uh, he's relatively new to the comic book community. Uh, just getting started, it looks like, in comic book collecting. He has a few videos out there. Uh, doesn't have many subscribers either. Uh, you could use a little bit of love in that respect. Uh, go check out his channel. And uh, yeah. Anyway, those are the 10 for this week. Uh, definitely check out their channels. The links will be down below. If you do enjoy my videos, please hit like. Subscribe if you want to watch more, and feel free to leave any comments or feedback down below. And uh, thank you for watching.